What's up guys? I'm Laura from Reading in Bed. This is Benjamin and over here this is Henry. We're gonna do an unboxing today and uh, what we're gonna talk about is the Ghost Box. This is last year's. Um, this is put out by Hingston and Olson. They're a local publisher. They are best known for their short story advent calendars. Um, but last year they came out with this thing and um, unlike the advent calendar, it's not a countdown yet. Don't, okay, our address is on that so let's not <laughs> put that up too closely. Um, the ghost box is just like it sounds it's a box full of individually bound scary short stories and this came about as a partnership with Patton Oswalt which is one of those weird things that just happened on Twitter kind of randomly but it worked out and I was not sure last year with this ghost box how much I would like it because horror isn't really my genre but we ended up liking it now the kids of course i couldn't read every story in here to them and just to be clear this is not a children's story collection this is for adults they are actually very scary um but we read a couple i think we read um this one that's a first here pumpkin head uh there might have been a no, few others we didn't. well they don't remember but i think i did uh so what we're gonna do today is unbox this year's ghost box which i think they just started getting mailed out yesterday so very new can I, can I please can I please help unbox it? Uh, sure. So we just got this in the mail. We're going to try not to put our address on camera, but uh, yeah, let's... So I've, I've already cut open the box, so if you guys want to... Here, you guys start opening that. Okay, okay. And we've got some of this fun ah. packing material, so let's, let's go for it. <laughs> okay. There's more plastic. <laughs> There's more plastic. Okay, what have we got? Hey, mommy, look at my side. Oh my goodness, yes, we have <laughs> packing material all over. And we've got some plastic, so I'm going to try to tear into here. <laughs> it was covering the phone. So these guys are excited today because it's also read-in week. I don't know if that's just an Alberta thing or a Canada thing, but I'm going to come into their classes today and do some reading to their uh, to the class. So I'm sure that's why they're so excited. Okay, so here's this year's ghost box. So it's got that kind of like... Shiny, 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 shiny. shiny. Yep. Now, shiny. just like last year's, it opens like that. It's got that sort of magnetic closure. Ooh, look, it's got a ribbon. Look at that. <laughs> cool. So that, yeah, that's the little introduction. And then we get right into the stories. I believe there's 11. Um, <coughs> so let's just, let's see who's in here. Let's see if there's any names that we know. Um... Because, you know, again, I'm not, like, super familiar with the horror genre, so I'm not necessarily going to know a lot of these authors. Okay, well, here's Patricia Highsmith, so that's a name I'm familiar with. Um, oh, well, here's Stephen King. Okay, so what I guess that one is called Grey Matter. Mm. Mm. Here's one called Uncle Tugs. <laughs> So it remains to be seen. Obviously, I'm going to read these first and then determine which ones we're going to read. Now, I saw already on Twitter that one of these stories, and I'm trying to remember which one it was, was about an island that's inhabited by giant snails. Actually, I think it might be the Patricia Highsmith one. Yeah, because it's got an island, right? So I'm hoping that this one is not too scary for the kids because that sounds like a lot of fun. Hey, we've, we've watched 18A. Yeah, I know. They, they've they watched movies that are 18A, so they think they're they're just about ready for anything. Um, okay, so that is this year's Ghost Box. Stay tuned. I'm hoping to hear an announcement about this year's short story advent calendar, um, also from Hingston and Olsen soon. Um, but in the meantime, we're going to get started reading some scary stories and probably a little bit of cleanup after this unboxing. Thanks for watching. Boys, you got anything else you want to say? No! Nope. Okay, thanks for watching. Goodbye.